Edo State Commissioner for Oil and Gas, Ethan Uzami, while briefing journalists and leaders of civil society organizations, said the state government is making frantic efforts to make petrol available for citizens to ameliorate their pains. According to Mr. Uzami, following the efforts of Governor Gordon Abaseki, who could not bear the plight, citizens of the state have been subjected to 780,000 liters of petrol was released to the state and would immediately be distributed to major marketers which will be sold at the federal government approved pump price. The government has officially set up a tax force that will go around the filling station and to ensure that we are getting products, ensure that the filling stations are being secured for people to have access to these products. Part of what the monitoring committee will do is to make an investigation to make sure that there is no diversion of products that are coming in into the states. As of today, we got 780,000 liters of PMS into the state. On his part, the State Commissioner for Communication and Orientation, Mr. Chris Nekai, said the welfare of citizens is sacrosanct to Governor Baseki. He said major marketers who jack up their price will be identified and punished. We appreciate and understand this issue of fuel because it's what powers most of our generators, what powers our vehicles, and it all gives us to go from house to house, market to market, we able to take care of our family. We need the fuel very seriously issue of the welfare of the citizens very, very seriously. It's something that uh, we have no choice but to do. And no, no government, just like no father, will be comfortable when his children are hungry or distressed. The special advisor on media projects to Governor Baseki, Kruso Sage, while commending the leadership and members of the civil society organizations for the peaceful manner they comported themselves during the protest to express their grievances over the sudden hike in the pump price of petrol in Edo State, said government will leave no stone unturned to arrest the ugly trend. Once any person is identified to be causing crisis, raising prices of products unnecessarily, causing hardship for the people unnecessarily, you know, putting our people through uh, unnecessary long queues just because they want to make profit, such people will be punished according to what the law says and what the constitution says. Patience, Osaugiwa reporting.